everyone, it's Kelsey again from the University of Waterloo's Faculty of Engineering. Welcome to our November edition of our What You Need to Know video series. This month, we're going to walk you through the supplemental application requirements. If you're applying to one of our 14 direct entry engineering programs, you'll need to complete both the admission information form and possibly an online video interview as part of the application process. As a reminder, this video series does not apply to students interested in applying to our architecture program. Be sure to check out their website for more details about their application process. Now let's start with the AIF. The AIF is required for admission consideration to all engineering programs. If you apply to Waterloo Engineering and don't submit your AIF, you will not get an offer of admission even if you have a 99.99% .99 high school average and meet all other requirements. The AIF plays an important role in our admission process, especially for our more competitive programs. Once you apply through the Ontario University Application Centre, keep an eye out for an email from us with instructions on how to set up your Quest account. This is where you'll fill in your AIF. The AIF helps us get to know you. It's how we distinguish between applicants with similar grades and choose students who've had meaningful experiences outside of school. We want to see how you'll balance your academics with other activities. This is a great sign that you'll succeed in university. Tell us about the things you've been involved with, both in and outside of school, within the last 12 months from the time you choose to fill in your AIF. The admission committee wants to avoid students guessing and predicting what they'll be doing this year, so they want the last 12 months of your involvement. Typically, this would include the last semester of grade 11, the summer and first semester of grade 12. For example, if you complete your AIF on December 20th, it would be 12 months prior to that date. There's no right answer on your AIF, so just be honest and show us the real you. We're not looking for any specific extracurricular activities and do not expect you to have engineering related experience. Instead, we look for examples of strong time management, interpersonal and leadership skills, along with a variety of interests. Having a part-time or summer job or a volunteer position that resembles a work environment can really enhance your application. All Waterloo Engineering students participate in co-op and having work experience to include on your first resume will make it easier to secure that first co-op job. So be honest and authentic. We want to hear about your passions and the reason that you're applying to the program. Waterloo Engineering students take program-specific courses from day one, so we want to see that you have a good understanding of the program that you applied to. Now on to the online video interview. This is required if you're applying to software engineering or if you want to be considered for an engineering entrance scholarship. We strongly recommend it for all of our other applicants. The process is simple. You'll receive an email to cure a talent online platform and be asked a pre-recorded question, given prep time and allotted a set amount of time to record your response. All applicants will receive one question for which they will record a video response. There will also be two non-graded yes or no response questions to be used for scholarship purposes. Applicants to software engineering will also be asked to compose a written response to a question regarding their programming experience and applicants to systems design engineering will be asked to record a second video response to a question used to assess them for the Kish Hahn Memorial Award. The interview is your chance to let us meet you and hear about your experiences. Be yourself, answer honestly, and don't stress. This interview can only help you and not hurt your chances. Our interview scores are trained to evaluate each submission fairly. We've even shared this year's questions on our website so you can start thinking about your answers in advance. However, we recommend not reading your answers from a prepared script as this is not as authentic as a real-time response. We're excited to learn more about you through your AIF and online video interview. Reminder, the deadline to submit both the AIF and the online interview is January 31st. There will be no extensions, so please plan accordingly. Be sure to check back next month for another edition of our What You Need to Know video series where we'll discuss what comes after you submit your application to a Waterloo Engineering program. See you next month!